Hey everybody, it's Christina of Crafty Paws. Um, I wanted to share with you guys uh, a quick thought that I've been mulling over in my mind for a while. First of all, this is a giveaway and a challenge video. Um, and you're probably wondering why I have, you know, basically <laughs> things that people would consider, consider trash uh, in front of the camera here. But I wanted to show this as um, what I hope will be an inspiration. Um, what I think is so amazing about this community is that you all are so, so creative. Um, things that you would consider trash like empty toilet paper rolls, empty ribbon spools, empty Altoid tins, cookie jar, wafer tins, this is some of my favorites, um, magazines, um, pages, this is just a Tide ad. And how cool is that design? Um, they're all, they all can be transformed into beautiful, beautiful projects. And I've seen you all make amazing things. Yes, you know, you all make beautiful things with amazingly beautifully designed paper packs and things like that too. Um, <clears throat> but you recycle and upcycle things in ways that I had never imagined before coming on YouTube. So my challenge is love the earth. <laughs> the title of my um, challenging giveaway is Love the Earth. Um, you must be 18 years or over um, and be a subby. It's open to everyone, international and new subbies, most welcome. The deadline is March 1st, um, so there's hopefully plenty of time. Um, and there's two parts to it. So A is the giveaway part, and the prize will be a small package that I'll put together or a $10 gift card if it's an international winner to an online store. Um, and all you have to do for that is um, comment and tell me what your favorite crafty style and color are. Just comment in the description box below. The other way to enter that giveaway is to promote the giveaway and challenge um, in a video response and that will give you two entries. So part B is the challenge part. Sorry, I'm not in the screen at all there, am I? Um, the challenge is the prize will be a large prize pack um, and if you're international $25 gift card to an online store of your choosing um, and the first way to enter is by doing a video response sharing the project that you have made um, and somewhere in the title put in for crafty paws love the earth challenge um, just so I can spot it and so that folks will know that the challenge is going on um, and hopefully more people will participate um, and you get one entry for that if you end up doing the project sharing video you don't also have to do a promo video I'll just give you the two entries for that as well so if you do B1 you don't have to do A2 um, but you'll get the two entries here and you'll get the one entry here um, and I'm gonna put this all in the description box below so you don't have to worry um, about trying to remember all of this. Um, the second way to enter is to send me the project that you've made um, in an upcycling way. Um, and uh, if you don't make videos at all on YouTube, and I know some of my subbies don't, and I think they're, they make beautiful, beautiful things, um, like Marie Housie, I mean, stunning, gorgeous projects. Um, but she doesn't make videos. If you send it to me, I'll make the video for you and you'll get all four entries into this part B. Okay, so not to worry there. Um, so those are the details of my challenge and I'll just give you a sampling of what will be in the prize packages. Um, I haven't divided them up yet. Um, but so I got this yesterday in a prize package, but I have ordered this one as well um, from <laughs> MV Treasurista. Um, and that was at the recommendation of Sarah Elliott, who's a, an awesome enabler. Um, <laughs> thank you, Sarah. Um, but I just love this little stamp image. Um, it's got a little fox on a leash, which reminds me, like it could be a dog, right? Like it could almost be like a Pomeranian. Um, anyway, so, and what I thought was so cute was this little tag here says reuse and upcycle. It's gorgeous inside and out. Isn't that perfect for this challenge? Um, I also got this um, Easter stamp set. 
um, which I thought was so cute. This little bunny rabbit is so darling. Um, it'll be great for springtime projects. Um, and I thought this paper pad from Heidi Grace would also be great for springtime and Valentine's. Um, but you can see all the paper patterns there. So sweet. Um, another stamp set. This is a Fiskars. This is Tags. Um, this Fiskars Punch. And I like these punches because um, even if you have hard to, a hard time with your hands, you can um, use the levers. Um, so they're good for people with arthritis and stuff like that. And I thought this little cupcake punch was so cute. It's great for, you know, kids' birthdays or adult birthdays. Um, let's see, a little thing of mesh bling. That could be cool for like steampunk or kind of, um, you know, shiny, sparkly, more shiny, sparkly. This is crystal -Z. This is in pinks and greens. Um, pearl strand trim. It's a celebrated package. It's big pearls. Um, this one is a Recollections Little Pearls and Bling Centers um, on a strip, on a roll. That's really cute, I thought. Um, some pink um, ribbon. And then this is one of my favorite washies. This is a little bicycle. It's just a Scotch brand, but I love it. I think it's so cute. Um, this pack of post-it notes, which works really great. If you're using like a little piece of paper and want to use the punch, you can put the post-it on the edge of the paper, slide it in so that you can use your scraps up and, and make um, punches using uh, sticky notes on the sides. Um, this little wood stamp that says homemade with love. Um, I bought this thinking I was going to use it for, you know, like if I started baking and stuff, but I don't, I don't bake. Um, I roast vegetables, but you know, you don't really give vegetables as a gift. <laughs> um, I cut up some of my 12 by 12 paper. This is graphic 45. This is, um, from the wizard of Oz paper. And I just cut up some sheets into six by six format so it would fit better. Um, so, you know, a little stack of those, um, this dear darling paper pack. Um, you can see some of the patterns there really great. I think for masculine cards, cause it's got some kind of richer, darker colors. Um, and then this, uh, crepe paper six by six party stack. It's got cupcakes and I love these Scrabble tile ones that say happy birthday. So cute. Um, so that's kind of a sampling. It's not everything, but I just wanted to give you guys a sense of what was going to be included. And, uh, I hope you guys will play along and I will see you soon. I can't wait to see what you guys create. I think it's fabulous that we are saving landfills, making beautiful things. Um, and I hope this will help encourage people um, to try it, recycling and upcycling. Thanks a lot. Bye.